This is my California issued ID, my driver's license on my phone in Apple Wallet. You can see it's from the California DMV, just has my name and my last initial. So I can tap this at the airport to get onto a flight, go past TSA, and I don't have to pull out my ID. Nobody has to know my birthday, see my photo, know my address, see my signature, any of that stuff. It's all secure and I can tap my phone right at the TSA checkpoint at San Jose Airport or SFO. More airports coming soon and it's safe and secure and actually through the DMV. Let me show you how to do it. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to add your ID to your Apple wallet. So when you go to the airport, you can just scan your phone at the TSA check marks instead of actually pulling out your wallet. So how do you do this? First, open the wallet app on your phone, then click on the plus icon in the top right and select driver's license or state ID. You can see you can do this for Arizona, California, Colorado, Georgia, Hawaii, Maryland, and Ohio. In California, it's a pilot, so I'm gonna select California. And you can see that my license is blurred out here, but I'm gonna hit continue. And it says scan the front of your ID. So place your ID up to the phone like so. I just have mine blurred out. Make sure there's enough light and hold it nice and steady. Okay, it'll scan your license. Confirm front of ID, hit continue. Then you're gonna scan the back of your driver's license. So do the same thing. It's easier if you have a darker background. So if you have like a black desk or dark wood or something, you can do that. Hit continue. And then it says verification required. To add your driver's license to wallet, you'll be guided through several movements in all angles of your face to ensure that it's actually you who's adding the license. So if someone steals your license, they can't just add it to their phone. You need to actually scan your face. So you guys can see it says position your face in the frame. Make sure you use a plain background. So use a wall or something and then hit get started. So I'm gonna move it over here. It says, hold your phone steady. Open your mouth until your phone vibrates, okay? Hold your iPhone steady. Now we're gonna turn our face a little bit. Okay, and you'll feel your phone vibrate as a little check mark for each one of these things. So now we're gonna do the other side of my face. This is kind of similar to Face ID, but a little bit slower. So I'm gonna close my eyes. Okay, it vibrated and it says, take a photo of yourself. This photo will be matched with your photo on file with the DMV. So I'm gonna take a photo. Okay, takes a selfie, I'm gonna hit continue. And now it says, review your info. So I have the front of my driver's license, the back of my license and my actual photo. I hit continue, use face ID on my phone. And then it has this terms and agreements. I have no idea what this says. Feel free to read through it, but I'm just gonna hit agree and it's gonna process my info. Now I know for a fact in California, San Jose Airport, SJC, and San Francisco International, SFO, allow you to use your phone to tap your ID now at the TSA checkpoints. It should be rolling out in a lot more airports throughout the state. You still have to carry your ID when you're driving right now. If you get pulled over, you cannot pull out your iPhone as of today. Today is September 22nd, 2024. That may be changing at some point. I don't know when that will be but this is the entire process to get your driver's license built into your Apple wallet. So it's ver verifying in progress right now. So I'll receive a notification when it's processed. So I don't know if this is automated or if there's a human, so maybe it'll happen tomorrow. Tomorrow is a Monday and that's it. Now it'll take you to the main menu. When I exit, my card is not added here yet. And tomorrow I should get a notification that says that my ID is added. Hope that helps. Let me know how it goes.